Makes sense. These are two really good players. Yeah. Definitely two players I'd expect to uh, see in our top 48 winners. Battlefield. Interesting. Alright, so PL starting off with the classic runs in, gets the nail, but now nah, it will find damage. Immediate up, yeah, of danger after the dash tag quakes. No, I like that paper uh, knows to parry these zero suit aerials. Like, he parried max range there from the zero suit. That's normally like so much percent if the zero suit hits that. Okay, at the ledge. Uh, oh, you gotta watch it. You gotta watch the paralyzers, man. I, I don't know. Maybe he also forgets about the bucket potential too. I, I guess paralyzer bucket won't kill, but you, I honestly don't know because I know it's like based on th like the projectile he buckets. Mm -hmm. But I'm not sure if like zero suit paralyzer is like strong enough for that. Right. Oh, he got the semi spike one, and he buffered air dodge, thinking that he would get stage spiked. Dude, I see. That, so many that's people. the one that hurts the most, Dude, I think. I see so many people die to that from papers game watch. Like they just, I don't know how he gets that so consistently. Honestly, that seems really hard. Oh, and now he's just going to work. And like the thing about game watch back air, good up the yeah, shield from the PL. Uh, the thing about game watch's back air is that it's. There's so many hits to it, a lot of players don't know exactly how many and when they're going to have to tech, so they just kind of start, like, buffering the tech. Yep. Um, and then they fall out and get an air dodge instead. Yeah, it's rough. And the ledge, okay, good get of attack, but still a lot of stage control right now for Paper. There's the chair, deep off stage, but okay, he's going to commit to the flip, uh, flip kick. Ooh, wow, he's fortunate that he didn't die to that down smash. Like, yeah. He got, lucky for he got paper, the berry, he was dead. PL rather. Oh, up air string? No way. Okay. <laughs> I thought you. Oh, oh, oh no. that backfired so heavily. I think he just like, hey, I didn't swing on the up B the first time. Maybe I'll just go for it this time. And then he's like, nah. Yeah. The down air. Oh my gosh. Snare is so much percent. Don't get semi spike. Oh, again. he had his jump, thankfully. <laughs> he almost got semi spike twice in a row. Up yeah, shield, not gonna kill halfway across the screen. Even like here, like Game Watch can live that. Okay, deep off stage. Where are you gonna go? Ooh, dang. That was such a good down air, but the roll gets caught. He doesn't even need the sweet spot because Game Watch is mad like. Okay. Set up the stage control here. Nice. Keeping Ooh, him the where he wants him. Oh, man. How he rolled that through miss? that. I don't. Did that roll have just enough invulnerability to just go through the paralyzer? It must have, but I like that from P.O. Gets the uppers and they immediately pulls back. Says, I know that the up is coming from bit, from Game & Watch. Can't do much about it. Just gonna try and stay under it. Mm -hmm. Okay, I like P.O.'s evasiveness right now. He's not getting opened up by these Game & Watch aerials anymore. He's realizing that he actually has the range to keep Game & Watch out. The Zare's coming through. Yeah, what are you gonna do? You're gonna do about it, but oh, neutral gets caught. Ooh, watch out! Everything's blowing up everywhere. Yeah, good recovery from PL, just barely able to sneak past the back air from Paper. Nice, oh nice my there God, to he back got that to Yeah, that is a hit confirmed, and that had so much range, dude. That was really good use of zero suit mobility. That was impressive. Yeah, that was nice. I don't know what happened, but like somewhere towards the end of that game, he realized that he had the Z button. Yeah. And then he just started abusing it. Yeah, I know there's not a whole lot Gaming Watch is going to be able to do about Zero Suit Nair. Or Zare, rather. Yeah, that's, uh, again, Gaming Watch, once he's forced to approach, that's when you can really punch him super hard because he yeah. just doesn't have a lot of ways to approach safely because he's just so slow on the ground. And a lot of his moves just don't have a lot of range, too. Exactly, especially with his new forward air in this game where he's not able to run in and swing at you, really. You know, he's got Nair and he's got Bear, but, like, they don't have a lot of range. Okay. PL trying to apply some pressure at the corner of the stage. Yet to punish a single roll on stage, really. I feel like if he's ready, like, to catch that, he can just down smash Paper. Oh, oh he gets needs it. it. Paper again. Well, Paper for the first time, not ready to shield that neutral air. The first time it hits is the one that beats the spike. 
And right now, like, if I'm PO, I'm, I'm running away. Like, I'm not even gonna approach, man. Oh my. This guy's a, this guy's a madman. You trying to go over the down air spike, too? All right, PO is actually just rushing him down. Yeah, no, PO's playing this insanely oh well right now. Gets the back here, forces him off stage, and all the way. Oh, he got the roll. And he pushes him. To the corner. Optimal punish. Oh, and he taunted on you. Oh. Oh. And he's going for the craziness right now. Paper might be out of He's just he's paper running right. all over Paper right now. Paper doesn't find the down smash. Still goes for the forward smash oh, and eats a punish. Man. Paper might be out of gas right now. PL is going to town. Ooh, oh, that he tech chase. Check oh, it's yeah, paper, over. Yeah, Paper just Gave wasn't up. having it. Dude, that was dominant. That was impressive, yeah. PL played that incredibly well.